in this video i'm going to talk about the drone rules of europe um we got a new set of rules um regarding europe um and this can be a bit confusing um we all want to fly legally but every time we fly a drone up in the air we think wow oh am i doing this right is this okay people are watching am i on the right side of the law but here i'm going to go through um easy explained version of the drone rules of Europe EASA okay so this is uh, divided in three categories it is open uh, specific and certified and usually most of our recreational people or regular drone pilots uh, land in the open category and you can see this uh, this drawing or chart here uh, this is the open category so if we see uh, the open category is divided in a1 a2 and a3 um, most of us is going to we are landing in the in the a1 you see over here you can fly over on, on a lot of people but not over crowds uh, that means you can just that you can fly over people uh, but with this thing you have to have drones under 250 grams so a perfect drone for this is a DJI Mavic Mini uh, 2 or 3 um, which are 249 grams and also uh, actually you can um, have uh, and as you see if you have to go to the A2 category, you can fly close to people, uh, but you have to fly with a safe distance from uninvolved uh, people. And drones in this category can be um, DJI Mavic um, 2, Air 2S, um, and also Mavic 3. But this is an important thing, um, the DJI Mavic 3 uh, goes in the A2 category, but actually um, DJI was the first uh, to land the C1 class. Uh, what this is, is that um, soon we will go over to the C class. So if you have the C1 uh, marked on your drone, uh, then you can fly the drone in the A1 category. And with a new firmware up update and not sure of the date but soon dji mavic 3 will um, get the c1 um, mark and it will land in the a1 section um, but for most of us people uh, flying dji mini 2 or 3 we will land in the a1 but in a2 uh, it will be most of dji mavic uh, 1 or 2 uh, pro drones dji air dji air 2s will land in this one and if we get to A3, we can fly drones up to 30, uh, 25 uh, kilos. Um, so this is a good chart to just look at um, to see uh, what kind of regulations there are. Um, yeah, if you have any more questions about this, you can just leave a comment and I will uh, answer as uh, good as I can. And if you love drones and want to follow our drone adventure, you can just uh, follow us and subscribe and uh, we will make new videos with drone related stuff in the future. So, hope you're flying safe with your drone within the regulations and laws of your country. Uh, I hope this was clarifying to your people. See you next time.